guys what is up welcome back to the channel family you already know what time it is game game we in this thing make sure you hit that subscribe button to be a part of crew smash that like button to see what it do y'all okay so let's get into this reading for you this is going to be for my scorpio so let's see what it do hey hey all right so let's see what the energy is like it's going to be a general reading for the next 48 hours okay you guys have been telling me how y'all like these readings so we're going to get into it all right but let's go. Next 48 hours. Scorpios with the man on the heart and the door to personal and happiness. What is going on, Scorpios? Uh, Scorpio saying that you guys are going to be making good decisions in terms of not being stressed out. Um, with the man on the heart and the door to personal and happiness. It's saying that somebody's somebody's going to be going through some internally upsetting and frustrating situations. Um. Somebody that has love for you is going to be going through situations where they're not happy um, whenever it comes to them trying to achieve some sort of stability whenever it comes to like friendships and relationships and trying to find individuals that care for them. So right now, Scorpios, um, there's somebody that likes you, has feelings for you, and it's like right now they're going through a situation to where it's like difficult, it's rough for them to try and like have stable friendships and relationships around them it's like things that are going good they don't really have anybody around them that they can say that really cares for them and with the blossom abundance it's like this is what they're trying to manifest as a situation to where you have some sort of sympathy on their situation and um you know could care for them or a situation to where they're not stressed out all right hold on So this is someone to where they be very um, emotionally expressive. So you could be dealing with a fire sign or somebody with a lot of fire in their chart. Yeah, y'all are dealing with fire sign. Somebody left fire in their chart. Um, very emotionally expressive in terms of their feelings. Um, Scorpio females, this could be you guys dealing with a male. Um, somebody that has a lot of, yeah, all I can say is a lot of fire. All right, also with the third chakra archangel, Camille is saying that it's geared towards this person's desires. They're very restless um, because they have their self all tied up in a situation um, that's regarding money. So it's like somebody's restless whenever it comes to their desires. It's like they've been chasing a desire um, and it's like they done formed some sort of long term relationship. And it's like they're in that relationship because of their financial situation. And um it's one of those things to where they don't want to be tied to that person, which is what's causing them to be restless because it's one of those things to where really they desire to be with someone else or they might even desire you, but it's like they are kind of like they have to be with whoever it is in order for them to, you know, make it through, in order for them to get through whatever situation that they're trying to have, but it's a situation regarding stability, so this is either dealing with financially or in terms of like living type situation. Which is um, why this person has became restless because they put themselves in a situation to where they're dependent on someone else. And it's like that's not what they really wish to do. But it's like at the same time they must have to form some sort of close relationship with this person that they really don't want to. It's like one of those things where they'd rather be free to do their own things. But you know how you have to talk to somebody and it's like you really don't want to talk to that person. But you kind of have to talk to that person because y'all are at the same job or whatever. Like, you know, because they like in the same group as you or something like that. Like, it's one of those types of things. All right. And then also, um, so with the Six Chakra Archangel Metatron, there's something that you guys aren't aware of. Um, you guys aren't going to be giving them an opportunity to get closer to you with that contract card. This one in reverse under door to romance. So this person's patiently waiting. So they patiently waiting for an opportunity to get closer to you, but you're not letting them have any opportunity to get close to you. Um, and it's only because the romantic life isn't working out and the relationship's not working out. They're not in a relationship. They're not romantically connected to nobody. So this is, um why they trying to get close and it's one of those things where they're not really giving anyone opportunities to as well and then we also have the angel of love in the temple path what's going on here okay well, it's saying scorpios whenever it comes to your path right here with the woman holding a coin your path right now is for you guys to just focus on being prosperous um focus on putting your energy into uh, very positive things um basically not this individual because it says with the angel of love and the angel of strength this went in reverse and saying that whenever it comes to you and this person being in your life um 
they got to work on still letting go of jealousy. You're not trying to have any jealous individuals around you that have that show some sort of love, but it's not it's not really there with that angel's dream. It's not too strong, you know what I'm saying, in terms of how much they like you or love you. It's like one of those things where it's fake love type situations. Um, so Scorpio's not desiring that. So this is why it's saying that you guys aren't going to give them an opportunity. All right. And then we also have the woman holding heart and the hostilities card. So somebody's holding on to frustration that's geared towards you because you're not reciprocating their feelings with that woman holding heart. And with the man holding the coin and the walking away card, this one in reverse. So it's like... This person's holding on to frustration because it's like they they feel like they forced to be in a situation to where it's like they have to walk away because you're not showing them feelings. So it's like they're tired of having a situation to where it's like they walk away from you because you're not showing them feelings. But then they end up coming back because it's like they still want to be with you type thing. So it's like they're having some sort of like internal frustrating situation based upon how it is that they feel in. Hold on. All right, and there's something that you're not seeing with the obedience card and the meditation card and the focus card. Okay, so what's not being seen with this vision card is the fact that with this obedience card and the meditation card, Scorpio is focusing on peace and um, getting things organized. This is what nobody's seeing right here. You know what I'm saying? Scorpios is, um, y'all, next 48 hours, y'all not going to be seeing, but I'm going to let y'all know that y'all going to be focused on getting structured, organized. This is going to be cleaning the house. This is going to be structuring your thoughts. This could be, um, you know what I'm saying, doing things about your day, whatever it is that you do to bring about structure and make you feel good and make you feel like, okay, I can look, I can sit down and I can, my mind could be at rest. My mind could be at ease because I done cleaned whatever up. I done did whatever. All right. Um, and y'all are focused on having some sort of peace uh, with the moon card, this one in reverse and the hope card. And saying that um, somebody's emotionally upset and hoping that you sit back and interact with them. But, you know, they're not seeing the fact that, like, you know what I'm saying? They're not even in your vision type situation. All right, so, and that's one, two, three, four, five, three, that's six of them. All right, so hopefully that helps you guys out for today. Comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see y'all next video. Peace out.